Create a new composition. 1920 by 1080 pixels. Now I want to tell you about the Kinetic Social Pack by Easy Edit Studio. This is a great pack that consists of ready-made montages that you can use for your own purposes. Separate scenes from which you can assemble your own video. Video format stories with a duration of up to 15 seconds. And elements with which you can decorate your own video. Now let's see the catalog of each category. Before getting started, let's import content photos and videos. Let's start with ready-made montages. Choose the one you like and import it to the timeline. Go inside the composition and find the content layer. Drop our photo here and scale it while holding shift. After that we return to the main composition and see the finished result. The next step is to import the ready-made scene. You can choose the one you like from a large catalog, edit them and combine with each other to create your own story. When importing a scene, the Essential Graphics panel opens on the right side. With it, you can customize the scene as you like. You can change the color, text, position and size of the text in all elements. Go inside the content layer and drop our photo onto the timeline.
go back to the main comp. Nice. The next step is to create a composition of 1080 by 1920s and 15 seconds duration. Let's import a scene from a collection of ready-made stories. Let's put the video inside. Next, I will change the color as I like and write my own text. Looks good. Finally, let's create another composition and see an example using the elements category. Let's put the video on the timeline and add a couple of elements. For example, this lower third. I will change the name, and the color suits me.
I will also add a kinetic line and change the text in it. Go inside the comp, find the text layer and write your own. For example, skateboarding is not a crime. In the character menu, adjust the text so that there are no gaps. Nice. Coder Composition Add to Adobe Media and Coder Q Choose H.264 format Check the box Use Maximum Render Quality Name your video. Click render button. And that's all.